Concentration is having the command over your attention. This is not only being able to direct your attention where you want it, removing your attention where you no longer desire it to be, but also the ability to hold your attention in place for as long as you desire it to be there. Now, concentration is a mental muscle. It's a muscle of the mind. And just like your physical muscles, the more you exercise concentration, then the stronger it will become. And just like someone who's been in a coma for four months, once they wake up, they have to go through physical therapy, you know, because there's atrophy within the muscles and they no longer work properly the same as they did before when they were getting regular exercise. And so you have to, you know, stimulate those muscles first, get them kind of moving in the motions until they can get strong enough to uphold themselves and then eventually as strong as they were, if not stronger. You know, but you have to build that up through regular exercise, regular physical therapy. It takes a lot of discipline and willpower to maintain that steady course. And the same is true with your, your concentration, you know, the muscle of the mind, one of the muscles of the mind. You know, the less that you practice it and utilize it, then the weaker it becomes. You know, especially like anyone my age, I'm 34, growing up as a kid with TV, you know, we didn't have DVR and TiVo and all that. So we just had to watch TV. And so you, you know, watch TV, here's a TV show, and then commercial, 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 TV show, commercial, 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 new TV show, commercial, commercial. You know, you went to school and it was this class, this class, this class, this class, lunch, recess, this class, this class, this class, get home, you know, homework, homework, dinner. You know, so everything's captivating your attention. Everything's commanding your attention. And the more that our society is realizing that people's attention is weakening, then the more that they are designing everything towards people with shorter and shorter attention spans. And so then it makes it even worse. You know, now we have the social media of scrolling, 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 done with that. You know, Twitter, scrolling, 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 done with that. Snapchat, scrolling, 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 Instagram, scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. And so your attention is just bam, 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 bam. And so with the way our society is built up and the attention so much being so debilitated through just going through life, then it is even more essential to, you know, get to the gym, go and practice every day, have you a daily practice of concentration. And so check out one of my other videos on different exercises that you can do for concentration and increasing your concentration. And if you're really serious about increasing your concentration, we have a 28 day course uh, called the keys to success that will help you to have twice the results in half the time. And it, it is focused on increasing your concentration and increasing your willpower and using both interchangeably to increase the, uh, each other. And it is found on the website. The link is in the, or in the description. Uh, check that out if you're interested. Or also, you know, I have different exercises that you can do on my other videos about concentration exercises. So check those out. I hope that you find any type of value in any of this that I've shared today. And it uh, aids even just one person to be able to uh, increase their concentration, especially, you know, if someone's you know, suffering the effects of, you know, ADD and feeling helpless and hopeless. You know, there is hope and you can take control of your life at any moment. Uh, you just have to put in the work, you know, nature will do half and you have to do the rest. So, but you have to do it. You know, I can't do it for you. I can kind of, you know, point you in the direct, hey, go over that way and you'll get to where you want to go. But you have to take those steps. You know, every major, major journey starts with minor steps. And uh, as always, I leave you in peace.